Hey guys, so yesterday I made a part one and part two video of an update since I haven't updated in a while. And in that video, I had said that Jesse had finally returned to full duty and that he was excited because now, you know, he was able to work out and do PT and just work more. And, and you know, it, things were going a little bit better. Well, last night when we were on Skype, he told me that he had a checkup yesterday with the doctors about that. And they had told him that if he had just been about 20 years older, um, from that point on, his life would have been in severe danger. And um, there was a 99.9% .9 chance that he would have lost his life. So it was a good thing that he is healthy and young and that his body was able to fight that bacteria that did go to his heart and lungs. Um, so, yes, he was very, very, very lucky. And I am so very grateful for that. Um, I'm just glad that he's okay. And just, you know, hearing that from him that day, as a nursing student, that scares me a lot because I do know my facts about spider bites and what they're capable of doing. So it worried me. It worried me that whole period of 30 days when he was on light duty, you know, because there's many possibilities that can occur whenever you do get bit by a spider, poisonous one at that. So, he is going to be okay, everything's fine, and, you know, I'm just grateful for that. With that said, speaking of Skype, this morning at about 7.30, I had woken up about 7 o'clock, I guess. Um, he got on for his bedtime, and he asked to Skype. Well, I wasn't going to do it, but then I felt a little bit bad because he Skypes me every night before my bedtime, so I figured I'd give him this. <laughs> um, I did warn him, though, that I wasn't looking my best. Um, I pretty much just combed my hair. I didn't have makeup on or anything. And we get on Skype, and we're talking, having a conversation, and all of a sudden, he stops typing and talking. When I say typing, I mean, you know, we chat over instant message, I'll speak, and then he'll respond. And he'll say a few words sometimes, but it's usually because his roommate is in the room, and he's always watching a stupid game, or some dumb TV show, or he's listening to some loud, obnoxious music. So, you know, it'd be pointless for Jesse to talk number one because it'd be rude to I mean I wouldn't even be able to hear him so yeah he just stops and he's staring at me and I just sit there and kind of smile awkwardly because I have no idea what's going on and you know after a few seconds he stops and he says I'm sorry babe for staring and everything but wow and I was like wow what and he goes wow so this is what I'm going to wake up to every morning. And I was like, yeah, isn't it gross or something like that? And he goes, no, sweetheart, it's not. He goes, if this is what I'm going to wake up to every morning, then I am one extremely lucky guy because you are extremely beautiful. And I was like, <laughs> it pretty much made my entire day. I have been smiling nonstop. Um, it was the sweetest thing in the whole world. And I mean, you know, because I'm really hard on myself as it is. You know, I'm always wearing makeup. And I think he's never seen me without makeup in person. Hmm. I don't think so. Anyway, so this is probably the first time. So, yeah, it did make my day. And also, he never says very many things like this out loud because it embarrasses him. <laughs> and then he'll start calling himself lame. They'll be like, I'm never doing that again. A couple weeks later, he'll do it again. But <laughs> I was extremely excited and happy that he said that. Um, I am really glad that he doesn't watch my YouTube channel channel <laughs> because he would definitely see this. I don't even think he knows I do this. Which 
is a good thing, because then it would kind of make it awkward for me. I'll probably tell him once he's done in the Marine Corps, but not right now. <laughs> At least not for a while, because, yeah, like I said, it could get potentially awkward. Yep, so that was my mushy gushy brag for today. And my little bitty update. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna say this. And before I say this, one creeper decides that they're going to take this suggestion. Just, you better believe I'm not going to accept your friend's request. Okay. So, um, you know, I don't get on here that often, and I obviously get on Facebook a lot more. I'm kind of a Facebook addict. So, um, if any of my military spouses, I'm just going to use that. If any of you guys want to add me on Facebook, then you can. I mean, I appreciate you guys watching my videos and listening to me ramble, listening to me rant and be upset and sad and happy and listen to my mushy gushy things like this video. I just, it, I don't know where I'd be without y'all. So if you guys want to add me on Facebook, you're going to find me under Chandler Wong. Again, if you aren't a military spouse um, and you try to add me, just, you better believe I'm going to ignore and block you faster than you can blink. I promise. That is a promise. So, with that said, I hope all of you guys are having an amazing day. And smile. It's a good day. Bye.